What is good, Xenoblade Chronicles 3 fans? We are eating good because Nintendo literally just announced a Xenoblade Chronicles 3 Direct. But whatever happened to that general Nintendo Direct that was supposed to happen at the end of the month? Well, I think it could still happen. What's up, guys? It's HMK once again. And like I said before, Nintendo literally just announced a Xenoblade Chronicles 3 Direct, which is happening this Wednesday, 10 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. Which you already know, I'm gonna go live 9 a.m. Eastern Standard Time with the Xenoblade Chronicles 3 Direct hype reaction party over on Twitch. Now, the thing is, I'm a huge fan of Xenoblade Chronicles 1 and 2. I've dumped over 200 hours in each, and I cannot wait for Xenoblade Chronicles 3 connecting the futures, future connected, of the two games, Xenoblade Chronicles 1 and 2. And yes, they were both canon into each other, even though they said. It wasn't. Anyways, I'm really excited for that. But a lot of people were really expecting, thanks to the rumors, thanks to the hype, thanks to, you know, E3 time, that Nintendo was going to have a general direct at the end of the month, specifically around the 29th or whatnot. And a lot of people are thinking now that we got Xenoblade Chronicles 3's direct announced, you know, today, that we're not going to get a general direct. Well, I don't think that's the case. And I'm still hopeful for a general direct at the end of the month. Because if you didn't know, back in the day, or I should say, well, I mean, yeah, back in the day, Nintendo has had multiple directs in line a week after each other when it comes to a game-specific direct and then a general direct either before or after one another and whatnot. And honestly, if Nintendo's going to do two directs this month, one general direct and one Xenoblade Chronicles 3 direct, I think it's a lot smarter business-wise to have the Xenoblade one out first because a couple of weeks one, the Malders that were expecting a general direct is going to talk about, how, oh man, it should have been a Nintendo direct. Where's a Nintendo direct? I mean, it's already been trending on Twitter ever since the announcement. And that madness and sadness and maldness, if you want to call it that, creates engagement, easy engagement in order for people to get to know that a direct is happening. And then those that might be interested in Xenoblade Chronicles 3 or just want something to watch can watch it on Wednesday, 20 minutes of goodness when it comes to the identity of the game. And I want to see more of that combat. I want to see everything. No, well, not everything, but I want to see a lot of good stuff. I want to be hyped because, I mean, other than some snippets when it comes to music, the land, the fact that the Bionis and the Makanis and the Titans from Zombie Chronicles 1 and 2 are, like, molding into each other. I mean, we see the sort of the Makanis in the, you know, carcass of uh, Uriah. Rest in peace. What now? I want to know more about how that happened and what led to that. So Xenoblade Chronicles 3 Direct, I'm good for. It. And then after that has been talked about, after they got 20 minutes of the game out of the way, because the game is coming out at the end of next month, then they don't have to spend that time on a general Direct. Because you know that they want to talk about it for the longest, for a good amount of time. If they were going to talk about 10, 15, 20 minutes of that you know, in a general direct, a lot of people would complain because they want to see more things like Breath of the Wild 2. I mean, you already know Zelda, right? And the possibility of Splatoon 3, Bayonetta 3, maybe a new Mario game, maybe a new Donkey Kong game, maybe some news on Metroid Prime Trilogy or Metroid Prime 4. The case in point is that a lot of people really didn't want too much time to be spent on Xenoblade Chronicles because every time that happens, you know, a lot of people look at the Nintendo Direct kind of sour because, you know, they've done that before where a general direct where they have, hey, listen, Tune in for 20 minutes of a uh, Nintendo Direct featuring new content and mainly focusing on this game. And then a lot of people are like, uh, you know, this is the game I didn't want to be focused on or I was expecting something different. I want Zelda, Zelda, Zelda. You know, that's happened before. So if Nintendo is being smart of splitting those two Directs, which they've done before when it comes to Smash Directs or Animal Crossing Directs or whatever, from a general Direct, which will give enough spotlight on Xenoblade Chronicles 3 and allow, you know, the other games be talked about in a general direct at the end of the month for the rest of the year going into 2023, going into the release of Breath of the Wild 2, that would be a lot smarter because, you know, if they were to do it the other way around or within that of a general direct, then the Xenoblade hype would definitely be a bit cannibalized if they decide to show, show something like Zelda, even if it was Wind Waker HD and Twilight Princess HD and not Breath of the Wild 2, that Zelda hype would have cannibalize the Xenoblade Chronicles hype a little bit. So get that out of the way. A lot of people are seeing this. You know, the Tunnel Vision is dead in center for Xenoblade Chronicles 3. And then a general direct will come out afterwards and it'll give us some more information. But Xenoblade will be like hard and pounding in a lot of people's minds. And then when the game comes out at the end of next month, it's going to generate a nice good amount of sales. And, you know, they can hype up other things at the same time or after the same time. I think it's a really good move, and I'm really excited for Xenoblade Chronicles 3, and I still do believe that we're going to get a general direct 
afterwards at the end of the month. You got to believe. You got to believe. You got to believe. But I want to know what you guys think. Are you excited for Zelda Chronicles 2? Are you excited for the Direct? And do you think a Direct is still happening after the Xenoblade Chronicles 3 Direct at the end of the month? That's so far being rumored about, but I believe it. Let me know what you think in the comment section below with your thoughts and theories. And be sure to like, share, and most importantly, subscribe to HMK for more Nintendo content every week. Here's hoping for that Nintendo Direct, Zelda Breath of the Wild 2. Let's get it. So until the next video, this has been HMK, and I'll check you guys later.